Hi, my name is Jessica and welcome back to my channel. So in this video, I wanna talk about how to speak more confidently both at work or just in life in general. The reason that I want to make this video is because I feel that we as girls especially, we tend to minimize ourselves and use words and language that make us seem like we're not confident in ourselves and make ourselves sound like we're not too sure of ourselves. And the words and language that we use really do affect our credibility more than we probably realize. So if you want to learn how to speak more confidently at work and in life in general, keep on watching. Okay, so the first tip is to stop taking back everything you just said with the words, but I don't know. For example, I think that would be the best solution, but I don't know. What do you mean, but you don't know? You just said it, what do you mean you don't know? It just makes you sound like you're not confident in what it is that you're saying. So instead, remove that phrase and just watch how much more confident you seem. I think that would be the best solution. I didn't second guess myself. I said what I said. I said what I said. The next tip is something that I have so much trouble with. I caught myself doing this just while filming this video and that is, to stop saying like and um. I say like so much, I'm working on it, but you should also try to be mindful of it yourself. It just makes you sound unintelligent. Hey, um, I was wondering if like, you wanted to maybe um, like go and have lunch with me. You just sound so dumb. So instead of saying like or um, just remove the words and pause. Think about what you're saying. You'll sound a lot more intelligent. I was wondering if you wanted to go get lunch with me. Way better, way better. My next tip is to stop saying the word just. Just is a very weak word. It makes it seem like you feel like you're bothering this person by asking them a question or talking to them. Hey, I just wanted to check in with you. Um, my client really needs that proposal and I just wanna know if you've had a chance to get around to it. If you say the word just, you might as well also start a sentence with, hey, sorry, I know that I'm really annoying, but I just wanna know if you got around to that proposal. Remove the word just. It'll make you, again, sound way more sure of yourself. The next tip is something that I also am so guilty of, but I'm working on it. And that is stop with the self-deprecating humor. And you know the type of humor I'm talking about. It's all over social media. really dark sense of humor and that's why I found this so funny for so long but after so many years of doing it I realized how it made me seem even if I wasn't actually insecure about something it made me come across as if I was so try to avoid talking down on yourself even if you are just joking because it does make you seem like you're not confident in yourself the next tip is to stop saying you're sorry when you don't need to apologize Okay, we as girls do this so much. I used to do this all the time, but I've gotten a lot better at it. When you say I'm sorry for things that aren't your fault, you just seem like you have low self-esteem. This is something that is especially important at work because when you say you're sorry, you just sound like you're so new, so unsure of yourself and people will take advantage of that. So instead of saying the words, I'm sorry, try to replace them with thank you. So instead of saying, I'm so sorry I'm late, replace it with, thank you so much for waiting, I really appreciate your patience. So those are my tips on how to speak more confidently. If you have more ideas that you think can be added to this list, feel free to share them in the comments. Thank you so much for watching this video, I really hope that you enjoyed. Be sure to give it a thumbs up if you did, and I'll see you next time.